Hi guys, in this video, I want to show you how I created my 3D avatar from just a 2D picture. Um, I did that with Relations Character Creator, and I'm going to show you how I made this tattoo on my character also. I mean this character on my desktop is actually myself. I use my picture, my 2D picture to create my 3D avatar. Um, let me show you how I did that. Alright, I'm in Character Creator now. If you load up Character Creator, this is the default project that is going to bring in to your screen. And this is the default avatar that you're going to see. Don't mind it's uh, don't mind that it's a uh, female is gonna we're gonna correct that in no time all right um, if you've installed character creator well and if you've installed all the plugins that is needed for us to do the job you should have this headshot plugin we're gonna use the auto mode to create our avatar so let me just click on auto and go load in my picture from my desktop. All right, about the picture, the picture that you want to load should be a very clean picture in the sense that you shouldn't try to bring in maybe an edited picture or things like that. Try to make it a very high detailed picture, like a passport. I'll recommend those um, two by two passports that we used to use for uh, international passports I believe you understand what I'm saying it should be a front-facing picture with your neutral pose looking at the camera and then don't try to bring in any shadows on on heat because if there is shadows maybe there's a part of it that, is, that has a lot of shadows or things like that it's gonna ruin the results so this is the picture that I want to use for generating it and that is what I have used earlier so opening character creator and i'll just drag in my picture in it and wait for character creator to do the, to do the magic character creator is going to access the profile that we want to use to generate our avatar so i'm going to use a mail so it's going to correct the avatar that is already that is on the screen earlier and then i'm going to use a bread and scalp to generate mine because it has been giving me a lot of good results so let me t let's character creator to do the rest for us I'm gonna have to pause this video for the time being because it's gonna take some minutes before the character is being created and it's gonna replace this one on uh, uh, in here and the good thing about CC the character creator is that you don't need to worry yourself about the skin texture because it's going to generate the skin texture just out of the picture that I've given to it. So let us wait for it to do the magic. Yeah, the avatar is being generated now. Um, let me close the headshot and see what we have here. Wow. This is the avatar. I believe it has generated a very good result for us. So that's how easy it is to create your own avatar from character creator all right in the next tutorials i'm actually going to show you how i made the tattoos on him i actually use photoshop to edit the the maps the um textures the textures map on him for the eyes and the other things and i'm actually going to show you how to clothes him we have a lot of stock clothes in character creator and also how to send it into iClone for animating all right thanks for watching the video i'll see you next in the next video bye bye